The right to self-determination allows the people to decide their form of government and to freely, organize themselves, without interference from foreign countries, in order to obtain a greater. This right is recognized in various international agreements on human rights approved by the General Assembly of the United Nations. The right to self-determination isn't linked only to independence but can be also be articulated to other forms like self-government, local government, federalism, confederalism, unitarianism, in accordance with the people's aspirations and any way respecting, as a key principle, the territorial integrity and sovereignty. There are two signs to the right to self-determination. The external aspect maintains that the peoples have the right to determine, according to their free will, the place they want to occupy in the international community of states, according the principle of sovereign equality. Meanwhile, the internal aspect contemplates that the peoples can decide for themselves the political organization that they desire, so as to seek the greatest possible economic, social and cultural development. This aspect contemplates the right of groups to preserve their identity and of citizens to participate in the country's political life, and this is the interpretation adopted by the unrepresented United Nations.